guys welcome back to the channel so today i'll be doing a avocado hair mask avocado with rose mint ear mask so that's what i'll be doing today so i did go ahead and blend my avocado i don't use fork to mix it because i don't think it will properly mix if i use the fork so i blend my avocado It's blended and I'm going to use rosemary rosemary oil yeah rosemary oil so I'm going to sprinkle some of the rosemary oil in the avocado you know and I'm also what I'm going to use wash out my hair when I finish I'm going to use so everything that I'm using today is avocado and they are this is vegan so no um straight avocado everything avocado avocado mm -hmm. and when i finish winching out my hair this is what i'm going to use to style my hair so this is avocado and cilantro styling mousse and this is the leave-in treatment so everything here is avocado that everything that i'm using today avocado all right so i'm gonna get my hair out so you might wonder why avocado why i'm using avocado today so i want my hair to look shiny I want my hair to be moisturized. I want my hair to be strengthened. I want strengthen. I want to strengthen my hair. Uh, avocado gives all of that, and also it is rich in vitamin E, which absorbs to the scalp, into the scalp, and the ear shaft. I always um moisturize my head before I do anything. No moisturizer. I always massage my head before I apply anything to my hair, and then it feels so good. And it also stimulates um, your growth, and it pro protects against damage and dryness. See, and so when I blend it, when I blend it, I. um add a bit of rosemary to it and after i blend it i and throwing it out I, I didn't want anything to waste so i just use my hand and just scrape out everything and wipe it to my hair right so why is rosemary all right so rosemary encourages growth and remember we are here for growth and i want to see how quickly my hair will grow because I cut it and I remember the first video I did I wanted to see if my ear grow faster taking care of it or is it just the same so we're here to see me taking care of my hair paying more attention to my hair I want to see how quickly it will grow so rosemary stimulate blood circulation to the scalp it offers anti-inflammatory benefits that helps to nourish the ear follicles. And guess what? I could go on. I could go on. Because rosemary have a lot of benefits. And you know, if your ear ear if if you have proper circulation, that will encourage growth. But you can do your further research as to what these two products do. So and I think it is a very good combination to use. So one for stimulation of ear growth and circulation. And this one is, you know, for shine and strengthen the hair. So it's a good combination. So I'm going to apply. I'm going to apply the. So I'm going to apply the avocado to my hair 
and then I'm applying. I'm going to apply from root to the end of the ear. If you see me looking forward, I'm looking on the mirror. I'm looking um, in the mirror. So Sunday is normally a wash day for me. Sundays I do my wash days. I wash routine. The avocado is really good for the hair. And as I tell you before, you are on this journey with me to see how quickly my hair will grow. You know, I want to see, I want to see, I want to see. So I normally apply with my hands. I don't use no applicator or anything. I just use my hands. Wait, I'm gonna put some more rosemary to it. I think I'm gonna add some more rosemary to it. I'm gonna add some more rosemary. Rosemary. Stimulate growth, and I want some growth. I think I might put too much, but I'm good. So my channel is not to tell you that you're going to have overnight your growth. I'm not going to try to mislead you like that. But if you follow one of this regimen, just stick to it, you know, give it at least two weeks to see if you see any difference. And if you do not see a difference, try another. Because one might not work for you, but the other will. And as I said, my remedies that I'm suggesting, they're not harsh. They're not, they are not harsh chemicals to say okay my ear will damage so i'm gonna be i'm so scared to try things on my hair no they are all natural they are all from the garden no chemically process anything they haven't gone through anything comes straight from the tree and i'm all for that because i'm not into the heap of chemical you know I remember when I used to process my hair, I used to dread when they put the, the relaxer on my hair because it would burn my scalp. And then after that, then I'll have to go under the jar for another hour or so. That's one of the, that's one of the thing I didn't like. And then you have to be under the dryer for so long. And then when I'm under the dryer for an hour, and when the hour is up, they'll say, oh, your hair is still not dry. I'd be so frustrated. I didn't like that at all. You know, so I really wanted was to go natural. And then some of these chemicals seep into your brain, in your head into your bloodstream, you don't know what all of those. Then you see people having all sorts of sickness and you wonder why, you know? So I'm here for all natural stuff, mainly natural, natural, vegan, organic. That's who I am. It might be a little bit more expensive, but look at it this way. Even though it might be a little bit more expensive, in the long run, 
you don't have to be spending a lot of money to running up and down to no doctor's office because guess what you are you are not full of all those chemicals you know in your body in your bloodstream so you better you spend a dollar or two more and do organic stuff you know i don't have to worry when i use these i don't So you're not going to see my shampoo routine because I'm not doing a shampoo routine. I'm just doing a avocado application and I'm going to show you how my hair look when I finish washing my ear out without product or anything. And you, you know, you can cast your judgment from there. All right, so I think you get the gist. I think you get it. And the idea of how to apply this to your hair. So I'm going to finish applying to the, to the next side. And then I'll come back and I'll show you the complete application. I'll show you the after. I'll show you. It seems like one avocado was not enough. It seems like I needed more. But I'm not going to go and blend anymore. But I use one avocado, one medium sized avocado. I blend it in the blender, you know, to get it to be creamy and really soft. So I'm just working with, with this amount. But one wasn't was almost not enough for me. I'm I'm not going to. So I'm gonna rub it into my scalp. I'm gonna rub it into my scalp. Yeah, I'm trying to encourage blood flow right here while I use the rosemary. And see, it's like, it's promoting definition. Look at this. See? It defines you here also. Not bad. It defines the hair. And the hair feels so good. And it detangles, detangles the hair because my hair was knotted. It was really knotted. Because I haven't combed out my hair since... Uh, since I washed it Sunday, I haven't combed it out. I, I have not. So, yeah, as I said to you before, just try one. And these are all natural products. All natural. If you want your growth, you know. This is a very good combination. Very good combination. One hundred percent pure rosemary. And this is rosemary. No essential oils. One hundred percent rosemary. Yeah, and it feels so good on the scalp. And I use one avocado. So guys, whenever I'm ready to, whenever I rinse it out my hair, I'm going to keep this in my hair for about 20 to 30 minutes because I'm going to wash my daughter here now. And that takes me about 22 that takes me about 30 minutes so after i finish washing her hair i'll come back and show you how my hair look after it rinsed out i might not put a a, a hat on it i might not put a cap 
a steam cap on it. I might just leave it as is. But if I do put a steam cap, I'll tell you. I'm still trying to decide if I should. So it's it messed up my clothes. Yeah. And I thank you all that support me. I appreciate you. I do. Don't forget to like, comment, and share on this video. Please share my video. I appreciate it when you do so. Please like my video, comment on my video. Please. I'm, I'm trying to grow, and I appreciate it your support i do appreciate it so i'll come back when it's when when i rinse it out and i'll show you how it look before i even put anything on it and as i show you before these are what i'm i'll be using avocado cilantro shampoo and it said it's sulfate free 100% vegan, moisturizes, soothes, and shine. And this is the conditioner. And it says sulfate free, 100% vegan, moisturizes, detangles, and it controls frizz. And this is the leave in. And this said 100% vegan, detangles, smooth shines so it does what it does and these are all i'm going to use in my hair when i'm through because i'm just using avocado for the entire week so this is what i'll be this is the stimulating no the styling mousse spray 100 percent vegan it encourages volume and body and shine well my hair is well thick already and my hair is really have a lot of volume when it's dry when it's not wet so the volume mm. but who need who, who needs a volume can try this so i'll show you after i finish and i might show you when i finish styling my hair i might show you that to see how it looks when i use these um products on my on my hair so guys, I'll be back about 20 minutes time. Okay, see you later guys. I just came out of the shower. So this is how my hair is looking without any product on it. You can see the sheen. It's so shiny and it's so soft to the touch. I haven't put anything on it. I just walked out of the, the, the shower. Yeah, I just walked out of the shower. So you can see how shiny my hair look. It's so clean. I tell you, I am not disappointed at all. I am not. My hair feels so soft to the touch. This is really good. Yeah. Yeah. This is it. This is it.